the next demo. Now, those hoses, I want you to take the heavy in there. I'm just taking the end that he used to stick in the, he had the, he had the water. <coughs> I'm gonna use the end that he has going to the uh, other side. This is crazy. I'm gonna to have to do some uh, math and the thing first so you can kind of lay that down now. Y'all kind of stand off the side over here. Cause I'm gonna do some more stuff on the board before we did it, actually do this demo. And this is a pretty important <coughs> demo. Where's my here it is? This little formula I'm racing right now, we're gonna use it again in just a second here. I'm gonna race it for now. Is a is a four inch hose half as big as an eight inch hose? She's she's looking at me. She don't know. Is it half as big? Is it twice as big or or, or what what? Eight inch? I'm going to give you a kind of a clue here. She's, she's pretty sharp. She, if she's right, but I'm not going to tell you what she said if you don't uh, give away my story. That one's that's four inches there. there. Depends on the inside. Inside there. Okay, now, when I first said that, the natural reaction is that a four inch hose is half as big as an eight inch hose, isn't it? That's your natural inclination to think that. But is that really what it is? We're going to use that same formula that I had a minute ago and got in high school that you never thought they'd use again. So how do we how do we calculate that? Area equals what? Equals pi r squared. Uh, so this is the four inch. This is an eight inch. Okay. Let's just do this one here first. Area would equal pi r squared. The radius is that's four and eight is two. Radius of eight is four, okay? So let's do this one over here first. Area equals pi r squared. So area equals 3.4 times the radius squared times two times two. I know what the answer is. I'm gonna do the math, but it's 12.56. What does that mean? That means if I took this duct tape and I chopped it up in one inch squares, it would take 12.56 the one inch squares, but when you type that area of the circle, some of them aren't going to be squared. But you get the point. It would take that many to cover that. And what is an eight inch? Area equals 3.14 times 4 times 4. Well, when you first look at that, that don't look like it's going to be that much difference. But boy, here's the kicker when you use this here. Actually, that comes to 50. 0.24. In other words, again, let's go back to this. I, I do everything in a simple way to, that you can relate to it. Take 50 of those little one inch squares. 50 of them to cover that one. So, what do we got here? How many times bigger? She says she, she was right. It's four times bigger. It's, it's four times bigger. An eight is four times bigger than a four. So what does that mean in this next demo we're going to be doing? Well, if you knew that, you wouldn't be in class here. This hose is a three, uh, three eighths, and this hose is a quarter. To a uh, quarter inch is what two eighths really, and and uh, another one is three eighths. So that's three eighths versus two eighths is what thirty percent bigger, isn't it? And this here is thirty percent bigger if you just do it in, in that. So. If it's thirty percent bigger. What are you shaking your head? Huh? Uh, yeah, he, he knows. But, uh, but your natural reaction is to think that it's thirty percent bigger. It ought to be thirty percent faster. Does that sound right? Does that, she's, she's got them all right so far. Is that right? She's right again. Uh, no, it's not. If you took and did the same thing here, you'd run into about the same thing. It'd be like a six inch and, a, and, a, and an eight inch, about with equivalency. The six inch is actually about a third of what a, an eight inch is. If you did that same math, same would we'll, we'll do the same thing here. So, how much faster are they going to load then? It's probably fifty percent bigger, really. We did we calculated it out, so it should load fifty percent faster. If you just do the straight math, but that's not what happened. Guess how much faster it is, guys and ladies. Let's do. I'm keep picking on her. She keeps getting wrong. I'll get her wrong on one. 
Is what? No, she said twice. She's finally wrong. Anybody want to guess again? 70%. Anybody think it's uh, twice? No, we know it's not that. Three times? Four times? How many, how many think it's five times faster? Uh, you know, this is a trick question, guys. It's almost nine times faster. Because what happened? There's, there's, we, 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 we started off with a little demo on friction loss. We hadn't figured any friction loss in this, have we? No. But uh, he was blowing through a long hose and a short hose. These are exactly the same length, but the diameter is different. So the diameter is different. What happens is, well, you've got uh, the friction loss becomes a greater factor. Then what happens? You got a thicker material in there, don't you? Then the center points. I had an engineer once. You have a way of explaining field that makes that stuff sound simple, but people can catch on to it, you know. And uh, I said, I, you know, I knew it. I've got to be a farmer somewhere that tells me why that mustard was going to load nine times faster. Oh yeah, he said, you take the delta q times the center point the next time. Oh yeah. Who needs to know all that, you know? So that's really what there's a problem with it. We'll figure that. Let's do this demo to prove that. Hey, you know, you, you guys, you this can't make a mess, guys. You guys come up here. What, what I need is one of you just to kind of hold this down in there. And y'all stand off the side here, just on, on each side so you can see it on the video. And uh, if it explodes, no, like, Mustard's everywhere. <laughs> hey, if you can't have fun at what you're doing, ain't no worth doing, guys. But uh, don't let them uh, hold them down for it. Don't get them all the way on the bottom. But low enough that it doesn't uh, suck air. And, and you zoom the video in on that real good. Oh, that's just a video back, and I said it's not even running yet. Okay, let's go. Keep make sure they're down in there good, you'll get air. Can you see what's going on? It's not even more being loaded, but I'm gonna kill it right there. That's done. Now, what, 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 am, what am I trying to prove here? Well, uh, you know, I'm trying to give you the physics of what goes on. <laughs> you said that, I didn't say that. Uh, huh? You said the same thing, size doesn't matter. It does matter too, but it's proved it. But anyway, what I'm trying to teach you, what, what if you get on a situation where you had to go back to that manhole behind the house? Or you had to get off in the lift station, you had to run a, a lot of hose off in there. Now, if you run this hose back there and you run an eight inch hose, nobody wants to handle eight inch hose, do they? But say, say you run a six inch, it'll be all right. You, hose. you run a six inch hose back there. Well, I don't want to do I want to do, let's, let's just run a four inch. I, you know, that's, well, but you know, I'm four inches Let's just run a two. What am I telling you? You're going to start getting in trouble, aren't you guys? You're going to get to the point where that poor machine is moving, trying to move. I don't know what size machine it is. If you have anywhere between four and 6,000 cubic feet of air a minute and try to cram it through a two inch hose, it's not doing any good. It's just the friction loss is killing it. You'd, you'd be better off if you just shoveled it out of there than try to do it. You're going to keep it stopped up. So try to keep the hose as short as you can on any job that you do and try to keep the hose as large as diameter you can when you get in thick, heavy, viscous material. In the case of centrifugal fans, it's just going to even work better if you get more airflow. Uh, possibly this place before, we'll talk more, a little more about those later pros and cons of both of them, on which one works the best.